Now, the Director General of the World Health Organization has praised India for its efforts in fighting the deadly coronavirus pandemic. In his regular briefing on global situation amid the COVID-19 crisis, Dr. Tedros Ghebreyesus urged countries to follow India's suit in having a multi-pronged strategy. He hailed India's economic package announced by Narendra Modi to be of real importance. Highlighting the economic issues that the virus has caused, he also spoke about how important it was for governments to put in social welfare measures to ensure vulnerable people have food and other life essentials. What India is doing, as I said in my statement, is very, very important. During shutdowns, there will be economic consequences on the country at large. But more importantly, individuals who live on daily subsistence, who give their labor for their daily bread, could be affected the most. And that's why India is taking measures like the 24 billion US dollars package and not only that, this will cover 800 million individuals as food ration during the difficult times. And cash transfers to 204 million women. And of course, 80 million households will also benefit for the next months from getting free uh, cooking gas. That's the kind of support we said it should be given. So we should not see it from the public health part alone, but see it from the angle of what the consequences of these public health measures will be on the community and try to support our uh, citizens. And this should be seen during these uh, difficult times, during the lockdowns, as, as so-called. Um, and that's how we can get the best impact, but at the same time, cooperation from our communities too, because if we understand and try to help them. But there was another important element I mentioned in my presser today because it's very important, I'll repeat it. Many countries, many developing countries, cannot really support their society, especially during lockdown. In the last 30 days, the number of positive cases has increased significantly and the death toll has more than doubled in the past few days. The head of WHO also expressed his deep concern over rapid escalation of cases where the virus has now reached 205 countries and territories. The United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres has also termed the coronavirus pandemic the worst global crisis to have hit the world since World War II. As of now, the virus has infected more than 935,000 and has killed over 47,000 people worldwide.